as you guys can see here the islands got completely rehauled the buildings got changed the textures got changed the models got changed it looks amazing and i'm not even trying to be glazing right now but let's keep it real the before and after is wild okay so here we got port we got the buildings right here and then we got hydra island which got a complete overhaul as well that island looks beautiful and then last but not least we got the great tree which probably some of y'all didn't expect it to be one of the three islands but here you can see in the background the great tree also got revamped got a couple of new structures in the background is looking really really good all right so enough about the maps now i want to talk about some of the basic gameplay that has been enhanced as well all right so the first thing i want to show you guys is the new quest npc indicator all right so as you guys can see these little indicators got a visual update as well and not only that you can see that every single npc in this game now has an idle animation so that just makes the game look more alive feel more enhanced and it just looks better overall anyway so when you go up to an npc they start glowing in a highlighted color the rest is still the same though but this applies to every single npc so if i go up to the next npc over here same thing happens starts glowing green as a green aura now as an indicator it looks way better than before because if you guys don't remember before this update drops or the current blocks is for you guys right now they don't move all they do is stand still i can show you guys right now so as you guys can see on the screen right now they are not moving they are just frozen the npc indicator isn't that good as well so right here we got a couple of more that i can show you guys it's pretty much the same but they have different idle animations right here and right here different idle animations just makes the game feel overall better and gives the game more life and not only that we also have new chest animations so let me find a chest real quick here we go as you can see in the old blocks was none of the chests would move they would just stand still and now they got some more v effect and they move got a new design and once you collect it it has an animation that plays with sound effects so it's not stale no more let's see if i can find another one real quick all right right here we have another chest which is the golden one click that yes sir we got some dollars coming as well all right let me know what you guys think about that in the comment section down below what do you guys think about these quality of life changes like the visual revamps of everything do you guys still like the old one and if you do you're capping or if you like the new one let me know in the comment section as well But that's just the beginning and i know you guys have noticed the guns stick into the side of my character all right in the old blocks the guns would not show on your body at all but now we have the dual flint locks which is a new weapon or a revamp weapon to show you off some of that i will be fighting some mobs not only did the guns get changed but the mobs and the way to interact now is completely different as well so they have different animations and again let me show you the before and after in this version of the current blocks was version for you guys the mobs did not have a stun animation or have any at all besides like the m1s now it's completely different so let me show you guys the revamp version and the updated version i'm telling you guys the devs was cooking all right let's see as you guys can see the mob got knocked back and it had a stun animation yes sir now it's not just them standing like nothing happened they actually have animation now let's see with this one see how i start glowing red when i get hit they also start glowing red when they get hit bop and another one a little red indicator i also want to show off the new observation all right i know you guys have seen a sneak peek on twitter but i just want to give you guys a closer look right here weave 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 y'all seen that y'all seen the new animation and the sound effects boy i feel like i got ultra instinct in here weave 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 yes sir all right all right next up i want to talk about is the gun itself and this is not the only gun that got revamped every single gun in the whole game got a visual revamp plus a gameplay revamp i'm only going to showcase this one in this video and i'm going to showcase the rest of the guns in the upcoming trailer i won't say when it is but just know there's a trailer coming out soon all right so here's the m1s i'm sure you guys have paid attention it has its own reload animation its own 
walking style when you sprint and dash as well has its own animation plus it shoots twice so the gun mains are eating good this update every single gun main in the game is eating good all right and this This is what it looks like with the purple aura tell me the new aura effects are not sick like i can show you again a before and after but i feel like you guys already know but yeah this is what the new auras look like for some weapons i'll show that off again in another video but here's just a little sneak peek of the aura colors all right another fact is with the old gun system you can see how this gun shoots two times before reloading right the old gun system and the old system in general would not have allowed that so that's why the whole gun system and the fighting system had to be changed in order for that to work and since the devs now added the new combat system for the weapons and other stuff it also makes it possible for the devs to add all types of weapons to interact with players or enemies all right next up i want to talk about the new ability hud all right as you guys can see right here these are the new icons and the new ability hud in general okay so for those of you who struggle to keep track of your cooldowns and stuff like that now you can see when it's back off a of cooldown so t is obviously your v3 ability which also got a visual revamp and this is a little sneak peek of one of them next up on j you have your aura so now you can see if it's active or not it will have a little highlight right here for those of you who always forget to turn it on you can see if it's on or not right here now and then the same goes for your observation you can see how many charges you have left right here you have nine i have nine out of nine it hits me for example now you can see those charges go down weave 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 told you guys ultra instinct you can see the charges right here go down all right and then next up we have the r key which is a flash step you can also see it go on cooldown right here it has a little timer and you can see when it's back up and you don't have to like assume when it's back up you just know boom actually has a 10 second cooldown don't quote me on the rest and then last but not least we have the v4 cooldown and let's see it which is going to be the y key you can see i can use it right now before it was grayed out and now since my bar is full i can just press y press boom. and that's it for the ability hug all right with all of that said we hope this video showed y'all a glimpse of the vision the devs had for so long all right we are hype as hell to be sharing all of this finally and we're just getting started i mean literally this is just the beginning for this update and the future updates to come we only included the basic game performance upgrades the fpc overhaul and the new combat system today but there's plenty more other things and one of those things is going to be the rework mobile controls which are optional so y'all don't have to use it but it's there in case you guys do want to use it all right so it just it gives y'all the chance to like try out new things and plus there's going to be minor things like the vip server controls and the new fruit system which we haven't shown today y'all gonna see it but it's not today now that the update cycle has begun i'd also like to share that the first update trailer is going to showcase all the new guns and it will be dropping soon so make sure you turn on your notifications for the premiere and let's get to it all right for anyone that's disappointed that this video isn't a trailer this was just to give you all some peace of mind which you guys deserve and that it's finally time to reignite the hype for the update and again we do want to apologize for the long delay for the update we know it's been taking unreasonably long but it's almost time stay tuned all right hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the next one all right peace